Hi, I'm Donna Eden, and I'm going to share with you the daily energy routine. This is a wonderful routine that you can do in a very short amount of time, less than six or seven minutes max. And if you do it every day, and even twice a day, you will start feeling better. You will have more vitality and aliveness and certainly clarity of mind. So I'm going to go through them one by one. First is the four thumps, and I'm going to break them down into each thump. The first thump is thumping right here on your cheekbones. There are acupressure points there that if you thump right on your cheekbones and breathe deep, you will, you will literally ground yourself, and you can feel it pulse down your body. The second thump is right here under your collarbone at the corners, and if you thump right there, there, it'll help you have more vitality as you walk around on planet Earth. And if you thump right here, this is your thymus, and it's excellent for your immune system. And the fourth one is right here, uh, right on the rib cage underneath your bra line, and it will help you metabolize, metabolize food, thought, um, any kind of uh, toxin even coming into your body, it will metabolize. So those are the four thumps, and they're great to start the daily energy routine with those. The next one is a crossover shoulder pull, and this is great to, um, to literally give you not just energy, but a clarity in your mind so that you feel like you're whole and complete. And if you've been a little sick or if you are sick, it will help you get well. If you take one hand and put it on your opposite shoulder, push in hard and drag over the front of your body to the opposite hip. And then the other side, just drag over. You're crossing energy over as it is meant to do. Energy is meant to cross over from the right hemisphere to the left side of the body. And this is, I mean, it will literally make you feel so good. If you've got a mate or a friend, you can have them do it on the back of your body and you will love it. Okay, next is the cross crawl, and it is also a crossover pattern. It is simply like this. If you go walking or you go running, this is really, I'm doing an exaggerated walk, and I'm hitting the opposite knee just to uh, show that I'm going to the opposite, but this is really good. It'll help your brain work better. It'll help all the energies in your body flow in a nice harmony. Next is the Wayne Cook posture. This next exercise is, is maybe my favorite because it, it works so well in my body. When I get stressed, I tend to scramble a little bit. Suddenly I'm, I'm just not as centered and clear and I, maybe I can't think very well. So this, it really helps your emotions too. So if you take your right, foot and put it over your left knee, your left hand around your right ankle, the right hand around the bottom of your feet. And now I'm going to breathe in slowly and lift my body and pull my leg to me a little bit. I'm going to go in through my nose and out through my mouth. And put your leg down and lift up your left foot and put it over your right knee. Right hand around your ankle, left hand around the bottom of your feet, and do the same breathing. Then you put your legs down and put your fingers like this with your thumb up to your right in between your eyebrows and breathe in deeply in through your nose and out through your mouth.
and then bend your fingers right into the middle of your forehead. Push in hard and pull across to your temples. I want to tell you something. I've had many people tell me when they could not quit crying and sobbing over a heartbreak, they do that exercise and it would just bring them back to themselves and, uh, and they weren't crying anymore and it sure has worked for me. Okay, the next one is the crown pull and it leaves off precisely uh, where you left off. So you start right here, right in the same place in the middle of your forehead and go to your temples. And then you go to your hairline, you push in hard and pull out to the side. Now I'm going to tell you what I'm doing or why you're doing it as I do this. I'm pushing in hard in the middle of my head and pulling out to the side. Now, what you are doing is you are making space in your skull, literally. Energy and blood and lymph, they're all meant to flow through your head and give you space to help you think better. And sometimes people get headaches or they feel really stuffy head and this really clears it up. So when you get to your neck, pull across the back of your neck and then hang on your shoulders and then take a deep breath in. Push your fingers into your shoulders, let your breath out as you drag them across the shoulders and just drop them. Connecting heaven and earth is a wonderful exercise that is probably the oldest recorded exercise in the world. That when you do it, you make space in your body so that energy can move and travel more easily. And when that happens, uh, any kind of healing energy can get to where it needs to go. And you also empty out any toxins that have been building up. So you rub your hands together real hard and shake them off and then put your hands with your fingers spread on your thighs. Now we're gonna take a deep breath in as we swing our arms together in a kind of prayerful position. Now you're gonna stretch up to the heavens and down to the earth, look up, flatten both hands and hold your breath. And the more stretch you have on your body, the better. And when you're ready, let your breath out and come back down to this prayerful position. And stretch up the other side. And back down. I always think that people look like they're Egyptians doing this. <laughs> so it's, if you can think, make yourself looking like an Egyptian, it works. And then back down. One more time. And then as you let your breath out this time, you're going to bend over and hang. And from this point, we're going to do two deep breaths. And as you do, you'll notice your hands go down closer to the earth. We're going to go. And when you're down here at the bottom, you're going to make a sideways figure eight. A figure eight going all the way up your body until you're reaching high above your head. Turn your hands backwards and let your arms down slowly. I would like to tell you what those figure eights do. They bind energy together so that there's a better communication system between all your energy systems. Okay, the zip up is a, a wonderful and important little tool to have because right up the front of your body are all your chakras and there is a meridian called central meridian and it goes straight up your body to the bottom lip. And so what you're going to do is you're going to take your hands and trace that meridian straight up your body like this and when you do, you're going to uh, imagine that you have a lock and key. Lock it and throw it away. What that does is it allows you to um, 
not take on the negativity so much, not allow things that, that might hurt you in some way just infiltrate your being, and it, you just stay stronger, and you can do it as many times as you want through the day, but when you lock it, it really works because this is the meridian that governs uh, hypnosis and self-suggestion. Okay, and now the last one is the hookup. And the hookup hooks up this meridian, central, and governing that goes up the spine. Put one finger in your belly button and the other at the third eye. Push in and pull up both. And it'll kind of often make you want to breathe because oxygen moves up. And it connects up these two forces at the back of your throat. And when it does, you suddenly have a spiraling energy that can go either way around your body. And it, it's, it's, um, it creates a force that is really strong and helps every other energy system. And it's called microcosmic orbits. My suggestion to you is that you try this every day. If you do it every day, you will find after a short period of time, maybe as much as two weeks, but not any longer, you'll feel, wow, I feel better. And when you miss it on a day, you'll know it because you don't feel as good. But after time goes by, it will start holding longer and longer in you and your energy fields will truly benefit. So I hope you use it. Thank you. Bye.